now that that's all done, I want to say thank you to everyone for, you know, joining us if you are. I doubt anyone's watching right now because we're about three or four hours late. late. Yeah. Uh, but to be fair, we uh, we're not that late, you know. <laughs> 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 ah, just kidding. There but uh, it's Axel as usual for Com Combos, and for this episode, episode thirty six, we have a very very special lineup. Not just one, we have several. Uh, and the lineup starts with our special special guest. That's why he's kind of in the middle, Mikey Neve. Also known as Michael around here, and actually most people might not know this. Michael is part of the Fail Inc. group, which is a subsection of the 3D Productions group, which is doing well. They're doing well in bringing reviews for that channel, my channel, so our channel. I am your leader. Kind of. He's like, uh, just <laughs> he's, he's, he's a very bad. bad boss. I am though. I don't offer demo, but. Uh, in addition to Michael, thank you for coming. Uh, I also want to give a shout out to the rest of our patrons who donate on at patreon.com slash C-O-M-I C-O-N-V-O-S comic convos. For those of you who didn't know, you can donate to us there. It helps fuel our prizes and different things like, you know, being able to do this podcast. Uh, in addition to Michael, we have Susie Marie, Psy Kennedy, who probably can't join us because it's 4 or 5 a.m. probably in Scotland right now. Uh, we have... Tyler Lockridge. I'm sorry. My and we have Kevin Hurt. And I believe that's all of them. We have five currently, and uh, we appreciate them greatly. Now, <laughs> I want to introduce the failing crew who work with me closely and are also in town for once with both Mikey and Lotus in town. That actually brings the whole crew together, except for Megs, who's yep. a behind the scenes Mags guy anyway. had to be at work. Yes, he had to be at work. Uh, we also have Beth here. Who is, you know, might be in training. And of course, in Megan. Training. <laughs> in training. Well, was, we were seeing how her commitment to the cause. Initiation hazing. And we have one person watching, it's probably Michael. Oh, uh, no. Just, <laughs> I'm, I'm, or it I'm might be us one. But right thank now. you to the one viewer who is here. I'm not sure if I can see comments here. I see two. Wait, they're gone? I oh, back wonder. Yeah. It does. What? Does. what? <laughs> Regardless, uh, I'm going to introduce the family crew. We have Tank here, also known as Forge. And uh, he's the all around carry tank of the team. I do everything. <laughs> I mean, the game. It's everything. <laughs> <in> the game. <laughs> <It's> everything. <laughs> then we have Lotus. Uh... Hi, Lotus. Hi, Lotus. <laughs> What's your name? <laughs> I guess Lotus, Lotus would technically be. I mean, Corey is also a vice president, <laughs> as is Meg's, of Valink, which is this a subset company. So, um, main president of Valink. Anyway, vice president of 3D Productions. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, Michael, Megan, Beth. Introductions over. Now we can talk about the good stuff, which is comic books, video games, TV shows, movies that have come Fun out. Fun stuff. Ah, and anything pop culture. I mean, we are comic combos, but we. Really do include everything in this, even anime, etc. Anime. Anime. I haven't, I haven't heard that. This. Anime. 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 Sounds like ham talk. <laughs> no, no, no. That was a great <laughs> anime. That one was. That one was. That was a great anime. Like, I, I wish they showed it more, though. They only showed it, like, one time period slot. It was it it is a trap. <laughs> it's hentai. <laughs> oh, my God, it is a trap. It's always a trap. Why did you look that up? I wanted to see if it was a thing. You want to see if everything is a thing. You had to make sure the abyss was staring back at him. Yes. It always stares back at you. Regardless. Um... Uh, I guess, you know, what, what would be the most recent, oh, God, Saw. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, right, right. oh, right. oh, I guess this so is also a Comic Combo's review of Saw. Uh, what is that? This was oh, Jigsaw. 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 It, Jigsaw. Jigsaw. it oh. just came out recently this past Friday. It's a radar movie. <laughs> it wasn't I it from my totally... It wasn't terrible. Basically, yes, like, uh, if you've seen happens. a Saw franchise, and if you've seen all of it, you actually I'm act, so kind of get a kick out of it. Right, at the like, same time. At the same time, poor, poor Michael over here decided, I think it was like a great idea. Oh but man, so, he looks so awesome. Some of us oh, were kind of horror veterans or kind of just horror mediums at that point. We kind of went in there and go, it wasn't as gory as any other Saw movie. It was just kind of like, oh cool. But then we found out at the end, uh, cool. Flashback. Flashback. Uh, Jigsaw was a flashback. That's all it is. Oh, God. You spoilers. Oh. You jerks. 
I'm sorry. They didn't spell really well, we didn't spell anything. We, did, we just said we just said a flashback. flashback. But they did that in like the, what two or three other every songs. other episode. Every other every episode. Other song. Song. I was like, which I, after how many points do you consider those episodes enough? <laughs> That's almost what I was like. All right, James is like longer episode. Four. <laughs> Like after four or five movies, you are no longer a movie. You're just like you're just series. Just yeah, some yes. series don't make that many episodes, man. That's true. <laughs> get a pilot. <laughs> get a pilot. Episode, you get an amazing man. pilot, and then. <laughs> yep, there are some of those. But other than that, as we rate Jigsaw, on my personal horror thing, I rated a 4.5. I rated a 3. Oh, God. I Actually, no. I, I, I retract my statement. It was a 2. Oh, okay. It was a 2. Oh, that is his rating, right, and I'm sorry out of 10. Yeah, yours is sorry out of 10, and yours is... <laughs> I got, I'll give it a five. It, as far as Jigsaw in horror films, it was like uh, an average B you know flick. You know what? For, for with good, with good, uh, good. I guess for some good, of the traps, for some of the traps in it, they I'll give it a five. I'll give it a five. Uh, for some of the mechanisms. The mechanisms are cool, but some of the physics are not. Like, they I think my favorite know. was the laser. Yeah, but the physics went up because that was the thing. Like The first time it fucked with me because it was the thing. Mm-hmm. I don't know, just spoil. The second time, though, I was like, well, no, that's not how that would happen. He went all squiddy. And I was expecting pumpkin slash apple. Yeah. Which is realistically kind of like... Kind of what you maybe yeah, like... Kind of like what eight lasers that went through? Regardless, your face bones don't just disappear. True, very true. Anatomy. And you not only that they're already it fragmented evilly. Yeah, it did. <laughs> like I said, it went it, it went eel. It, like, it, it went freaking squid on me. It went, it went cut a pot. It went it went let's And you would know what this is. <laughs> as soon as you spend see it. money. But do not <laughs> spend money to see this shit. And we spent exactly eighteen dollars. Hey, Izzy is uh, is watching. Thank you, Izzy. We appreciate you. Oh, oh, share the post <laughs> share the <laughs> with the world. We need to be heard. But, no, I, th- I thought, you know, it's like it wasn't super necessarily terrible. It just was not impressive at no. all. No. Like, it was mediocre on every scale and then... Sl- but, but, nonetheless, it was a movie that we made memory of. Oh, yeah, us. now, oh, except yeah. for Michael. Michael's, Michael's going to burn. Michael's meme. Michael's meme. It doesn't have a... It has a... It's a meme now. It's so good. Bad. It's so bad. It is. All right, so, so not regarding that, let's talk about something else that's coming out, even though we haven't seen it. Uh, Zach's going to be the first one to see I'll it. Thor yeah, I gotta wait till tomorrow night. Oh, man, there's spoilers. How it kills somebody. Why? Oh, oh, my God. Why are you guys spoiling oh, that for me? Oh, oh, I know. Oh, oh, my God, man. No, it was posted online. No one posted. I didn't see, I didn't see, see that. Oh, my God. God. No. Spoilers. Oh, my God. Spoilers. So anyway, right. well, so for those of you that don't oh, know what Thor is, is or Thor Ragnarok, it is the 80s version of Thor. Um, it's got a lot of good, amazing 80s theming throughout the entire trailers, so it's Perfect, but that's probably not how it's gonna be. No, and that's the thing. I think that they, well, and there will be times, but and that's the thing. Everyone's always like the DC trolls, man. You should see the the things. And I hate to say that because that makes me seem Marvel trolly, but every time I see it, it's like. They're, they just feel this incredible bias towards them. Like everyone hates them, and they just because they're not like Marvel, and that Marvel's all comedy and no seriousness. Why can't we expect Marvel? some seriousness in this for this one? For sure, I mean, the one you get Helia, who's going to be doing some shit, somebody, right? She's gonna do some shit. The thing is, and here's the thing: it's like I just feel like who is out of her own plane. Yeah, that she's would be in Asgard, which is right, but that makes her weaker mean, technically. She's master of her own plane, exactly. In, in the comic books, so maybe so, she's stronger here, like freed of hell. But is but do we know if Helia takes? Because in the trailer, you see that she destroys the hammer, mm-hmm. but we don't know if that's in her plane or in Asgard, right? Or really even what that means at all. Because in the comic book, spoiler alert: <laughs> every piece of Mjolnir is endowed with. The entirety of the yeah. power of Mjolnir. So yeah. if you can, so, you know, subset like let's say a frog or something. That, which, <laughs> spoiler alert: <laughs> the frog is coming. The frog, also known as Throg. <laughs> throg. Is coming. Oh, his story is actually throg. way better than what Thor's. Mean, throg? It is kind of it's it's Throg, but it's it's it's, it's funny. He he picks up a sliver of Mjolnir and he's worthy. Which, by the way, if you have not seen any Wait, of the. Any of the Marvel Frogs oh oh, series or comics, you need to see that stuff. Oh my god, I, I love that. And I love that that was so popular, they pulled some of it into the regular series, like they get turned into frogs quite regularly, trust me. 
the but no, good. like Iron Man Frog is probably my favorite frog because he's useless. <laughs> <laughs> Every other frog, like, it's like, oh, he's a frog, but no, that's the frog with the skills of Captain America, bro. <laughs> Throw a lily pad and make him out of back. No, you should see some of the craziness that, like, in the comic books but and in, in, some, in the animation. Black Panther and people like that can, like, beat up giant man and stuff by, like, jumping up their body and beating the shit out of, like, tendons. And, yeah. Doesn't Squirrel Girl defeat Don't even us. get me started. <laughs> Don't even go there. Squirrel Girl, Girl oh, who's man. never defeated anyone and fucking can't, like, on, on screen. screen. Yeah. But yeah, she's defeated all of them. Oh, yeah, she defeats oh, Doctor Dead Doom. Dead I thought that, I thought that, uh, Dead, oh, yeah, the, Squirrel well, Girl's coming in eventually. She's coming in New Avengers, I think, oh, is the yeah, series yeah. she's coming in, which is coming, or not New Avengers, uh, New Mutants. Which I don't know. How I thought that be. started, didn't it? No, no, no. That is a uh, different one. That's you're thinking of the just gifted. Started. You're thinking of the gifted and Inhumans. Which I thought both. the gifted was the second season of it. No, the gifted is the first season. Oh, okay. And then Inhumans started its first season two with an IMAX run. Yep. What? Which they shouldn't have done. They shouldn't have done that. Because the, and they learned their mistake. Or they, I even saw a post from a quote from theirs, which is like, uh, people expected it to be a movie release when really it was a fucking two, two episode TV release yep. on IMAX screen, which only shows the TV and its flaws even bigger. Yep. So like it was like it wasn't bad. It looks fine. It's just not super high class for yeah. IMAX. And uh, the story is a little slow. Like it takes time. I it, it, they try to make you endear to the characters before launching into too much craziness. That's why if you ever go see any sort of TV series that gets put into the theaters, I'd recommend anime. Yeah. Over anything, because at least it can hide itself in its animation. Oh, God, thank God. This animation is so dope. Yeah, like yeah. Alamo did My Hero Academia recently. Oh, God, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. So good. That's such a good series. It is, so it is though. My Hero Academia is amazing. It My is. heart is with Toriko. Watch that yet. Watch it. Toriko is more yeah. Toriko for me. I really wish they would do more Toriko. It's, it's over. I need to finish. But, uh... <laughs> Thor Ragnarok. Thor Ragnarok. Else, anybody, anybody else gonna see that? Um, tomorrow. I'm not gonna be. I'm not allowed to. I'm not allowed to. I'm not allowed to. It may be even. I don't mind. I might have to do something here. I think, but, but I don't have the luxury of doing that here. Well, I'm you sorry. You I mean, technically, we could have technically. Out we technically. I, we talked about this. We technically could have done that instead of Korean barbecue. That is true. But we talked about Korean barbecue. I was hungry. I was hungry. Eat some Next fucking we'll bread, you fat fuck. Uh, too much profanity. Oh, I only uh, curse at these guys that much. Just kidding, I curse on here all the time. Is it right? Okay. Like, <laughs> so make sure that you go out there and support anything that comes out because that's the only way you get more of it. And better. Like, yep. Yeah. The more you support it, the more it'll Call them out on their bullshit, though. Yeah, tell them, <laughs> like, you can go watch it and then review it badly. That is... Yeah. Yeah. So, wait a minute. Like, we have some we're not telling you, you to go watch really shitty movies. We're telling you, like, go give movies a try. That goes with anything. Though. Yeah. And then you can tell people it's a shit movie and not to go see it, but that's different. Dude. But also remember, keep an open mind. Like, I still have one track my superhero movies. People. Oh, yeah. And like, that's not. to say, like... There's, I'm, I'm trying to keep a good open mind for Justice League because I want it to be good. Yeah, Punisher 15th, so. right? Yep, same night as the Punisher. I Punisher. Want, I want it to be good. But... Punisher Netflix or Punisher? Yes. Yeah. Netflix Punisher. Do you use my Netflix? This is like, I'm sure you have Netflix. I have Netflix. Netflix. I have Netflix. <laughs> Everyone has Netflix, yeah, man. It's like Shrunk. Except Michael. Can't I sh- I, I, yes. use my Netflix, <laughs> yes. Michael. Oust me. Except Oust the me. Devil. <laughs> we just ousted the Patriot. <laughs> yeah. It's alright. He's already having fun tonight. But At least he's not broken. Other than that, Ragnarok, yeah. I'm, like, for me, <clears> I'm not going to get to see it until it comes out on DVD. So, and basically, in my judgment, <laughs> someone have to, like, steal me. Someone I have to, like, literally you. come over, grab the trench coat, and, like, steal me into the movie theater. It's gonna be no like, basically, I can take you in, but then Andrew will be left to take <laughs> yeah. you and your mother, yeah. and they'll probably both die. <laughs> He's not wrong. He's not wrong. We'll, we'll skip all of we'll that. We'll skip to that. Back to Dude, the comic for comic. Ragnarok. Um, honestly, I got nothing else really to say about it. Yeah, there's not much to say until we see it. I'm excited for it. Next all week right. probably will be a Thor Ragnarok review. Oh, I uh, guarantee for us. Especially it since Leo's unfortunately sick tonight. Yeah. Yeah. And it happens. Especially as the sick. More like went to go see Thor Ragnarok. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, actually, 
actually, Leo and I have, well, through Leo's website, have a press pass, mm-hmm. so we go to get, get to go see those early if we want. I didn't nice. get to go do it because I'm broke. Because I'm broke. <laughs> and didn't have time because I was hanging out with you guys. Hey, what? Because they're in town. So, it's not often I get to see these two employees. I've seen I put this in extreme quotes here because I don't pay them and they don't do any work. <laughs> it's like quotes. Extreme quotes. <laughs> the extremist. Did you see how many quotes I put there? so many quotes. I'm watching your quotes as we speak. Just, oh god, in this blur. It's so terrible. Um, but other than that, yeah, no, like that, that's really cool. So, what's what I'll, besides hype are you for Justice League? I'm pretty hyped. Like everyone else is like, oh, it's gonna be a CGI piece of shit. I'm it, like, it's I don't so know. I just as far as the trailer, like, could you do any of that. this without making it look like a CGI fuck face? No, it's like an entire I face. I, scene. I, I, I think that they really needed to re. Choose Cyborg's outfit because it's too much yeah, Cyborg's outfit metal. Weird. Too much hard metal. If they went for a smooth line metal, I think it would have been much better. You think for the kind of metallic body form stuff? Yeah, because yeah. Flash's suit looked amazing. Yeah, but and, and, well, fair. Well, well, it's 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 got some problems that I don't like, but most of it looks great. Like his helmet looks amazing. They all, they also softened it up, and ever since then, I wasn't happy. Did you see the softening? No, I think they softened it up since that part. But a lot of a lot of cyborgs problems because you got a bunch of that, and it's going to be really it's going to just throw off a lot of people. But that's something that really, in the end, doesn't matter to most audience members. They just want a decent decent show, dude. And that's the thing people forget is it's not about like everyone wants this deep. Like crazy, oh, accurate. It's like no, Marvel did figure out that it's about making a good movie first yeah. and then making it Marvel as much as you can. Bah, 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 bah. Mm-hmm. And, and they do a good job. Like yeah, you've been taking formula, that, and it's working. It's really working. Like even the bad movies are watchable. Yep. Mm-hmm. Like the worst. What's the worst? I mean, like I say, worst. Thor, like the worst. Spider Man Three. The Thor I don't count that. Yeah, that's Sony. Sony. <laughs> that's Sony. <laughs> Actually, no. Thor Two is pretty bad. It's pretty bad. Both of them. It was better. It was the original Thor was all right, but both I of them like I still don't like that. And then I'm, I feel like Iron Man rate, two they rate was lowest pretty on shit. Iron Man two and three were very good, but Iron Man three is one of the highest ranked movies. In the Iron movie. Man three. The, I didn't like three. I didn't because of the villain. Yeah, yeah, they didn't make the man. They didn't make him right. Yeah, that was bad. Oh shit! Oh, it's don't worry. Alarms. It's an alarm. It's alarm. Right. We're good. Okay, okay look, we have three viewers now. Sorry, we gotta look at them. Justice League hype Clay Flash's armor suit is badass. Hey, I agree, Clay. Clay uh, joins us from the Guardians of the Nerdiverse group page, oh. and he is an awesome guy. Thank you, Clay, for commenting. It's all right, we didn't see it till now, and we'll try to keep it up. I don't want I'm to hoping I'm not lagging too much. Yeah, we're having a good conversation. <laughs> Why did you not tell me, Michael? <laughs> <laughs> He's open as well as our door. We just they literally joined. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you will see comments. My employees <laughs> are the <laughs> worst employees. Ow, in the ow, world. ow, I'm sorry. I'm not that cool. I forgot about that program. <laughs> I am so not. <laughs> all right. Mean. So what's our? All right. So besides that, I'm ter- dissing on how terrible the first the first two Thor's were. Hey, the first Thor was fine. It was okay. The second Thor was so for that, All right. I'm sorry to say this, but it was kind of eye candy. The thing is, like, I don't hey, really remember hey, most of it. I remember the fight scenes and the too. funny shit. <laughs> Uh, all right, I remember a little more as I do that. All right, to be fair, I will give both the, both of the Thor movies do have that in being that despite the fact they were not very good movie wise. Like my mother straight up told me she's like, I never understood why they had to show a woman with like half naked and no clothes until I saw Chris Hemsworth in that movie with the shirt off, <laughs> and I was like, Mother, I don't need to know that. Yeah. First of all, <laughs> Chris Hemsworth with the shirt off, it's. Uh... It was a shower scene that do I need to explain it? Yeah, that's the size of the show it is. Look, there's only one way I got her to keep watching Sons of Anarchy, and that's because of Jack Teller. Yeah, right, fair <laughs> enough. I've only, I, and I couldn't watch after the beginning of season two. Because, of, because I felt like the character decision for uh, the lead patriarch at that point was really weak. Yeah, they made oh, bad right. Like they, it, I'm sure it did eventually, but I, it was so out of character for me. I was like, "That's bullshit." She would have ran up with like shotguns and fucking burned the whole town down by her fucking self. Yep. 
She would have told nobody. She'd call. She'd call like one motherfucker. <laughs> she'd have burned down the whole town to kill those assholes. Oh yeah. But you know, I mean, that's just me. Yeah. Oh god, now I got all of these guys here. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be able to see comments. So that's too far away from me. I appreciate that because I don't. I can't do it. My phone did. Yeah. No, and it would be really awkward to move over there, turn that on, get my thing, and I yeah, come back. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, Especially good. when I can just look over there. Welcome really to Combo Conversations. Oh, we yeah. talk about anime and random hero superhero things. Um, oh, yeah, we definitely. Say that a long time ago? Oh, yeah. Sometimes we talk about... So what, besides... <laughs> right, 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 besides besides Disney old movies and movies we've just seen to diss, movies that we're looking forward to either enjoying or dissing, What's the most recent? <laughs> I think it'll be alright. I, I mean, I see what all so they're trying to do. Dude. It's, it's gonna, gonna be, be so good. It's gonna be so. Dude, good. like the the premise of the last trailer really makes you wonder what yeah. uh, what is going on. Is is uh my God, I forgot her name. The Ray is Ray actually going to be good? Will she be the first time that we actually see a Jedi? Well. Jedi in training go choose the Jedi path or will she go for the dark side and be a hero character that fell to the darkness right and that's why I'm wondering if they take the switch because in the last set of movies and even in the one before you see the character switch Anakin yeah. goes oh. being the hero oh. in, in two. Oh. hold up have you not seen the most recent trailer no just, just hold up hold up I want to know why it has to be either light or dark why she have to you well, can't have gray. The gray. can't be gray. You can't be the gray. You can't be gray anymore. Only Luke's. Oh my God, be gray. Death did too. Death did too. <laughs> I'm gonna. I, yes. <laughs> be lucky there's not like Look, more it's not, shit. It's unfortunately, it's not like Twitch where more viewers bring it up for higher views. Yeah, no, it doesn't work like that. No. So, so uh, <laughs> stuff with what we got. Hey man, I appreciate you guys. We're fine. <laughs> We're doing our job. The thing is, some of these are. We're shows. working for you, Mr. Boss. <laughs> the other thing is that you finally, see, uh, <laughs> finally, you get to see um, God, I forgot his character. Uh, the new bad guy, not Snoke, but anger tantrum man Kylo is oh, going Kylo? Yeah, Kylo Ren is going to be I think, yeah, I think they're decision. doing the reverse I think they're running the reverse but I think they also showed this hinting because they definitely they're have to definitely kill off hinting of killing off Cherry Fisher. well I mean I, there's no hinting at that <laughs> she's going to die this fucking movie everybody knows if there's one spoiler that's not a spoiler Carrie Fisher's character dies in this fucking movie <laughs> unlike last time where everyone was spoiling the fact that Kylo oh sorry hang on no I don't know I mean, you like, haven't seen the first one. You haven't seen which is that. actually the seventh the one. Yeah. Which is actually the one. Yeah, because I found that out before the movie. I'm like, sorry. I if you haven't it, seen the time. seventh Star Wars, turn this conversation My mother right really now and cried. And go watch it. And then come back. And then you won't, uh, miss, the you won't miss the thing because Trust it'll me. be recorded in forever in posterity and no one gives a shit. And but uh, spoiler alert. Kylo kills Han Solo. Oh my god! Oh my god! Han Solo, how could you? Which I was a spoiler that got ruined to everybody because that's what everyone threw out in chats of every everywhere. Show. It was legit like a meme at one point. It was like there would be a fact and like halfway through it'd be like Han Solo is, dies in fucking new movie. It wasn't even like oh man. Yep. Oh man. And then there there was one uh, I know one of my friends, he posted a video. It was basically some girls twerking and it flashed Kylo Ren kills on so I'm like you're an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> he said his hand down his pants. So fun fact. I was like, what the hell is this? Oh, fun, fun fact man. about that entire thing about Han dies in the second movie. He was supposed to die in the sixth one. He was. He yeah. was. But the problem with production and cost, he wanted a little like they couldn't exactly fund the extra half hour to throw that in of how he dies. Yeah. And I was he like, takes himself out in a. Uh, it's uh, a imperial base, isn't it? That's he takes out an imperial actually. cruiser or something yeah, yeah. like that. Yeah. He suicides. He does a badass fucking thing yep. to get in there and do some crazy shit, and then he dies. But, uh... He did go out and... The new one's gonna be cool. great. The new one is gonna be great. I like that they're not afraid to kill more characters in this one. Dude, did you see those fucking ice wolf things? Those yes. look amazing. The, what do they call them? The Arctic foxes? Yeah. Or the something like that. Crystalline how, foxes. And how about the creepy pork oh, thing? Or the, oh yeah, the porks. <laughs> what do you mean porks? Creepy. They're fucking yeah. adorable, you bitch. <laughs> <laughs> did you see it? It went, woo! <laughs> Speaks 
the souls and minds of children. <laughs> <laughs> it's a monster. I want to go see it now. <laughs> I'm going to eat it. Oh, okay. Finn versus Phasma. That's another thing that came up in the trailer. That was a great oh, small scene. Dude, and the, 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 the proto sabers? The proto sabers? Will, will Phasma actually do something? Because she's a badass. Dude, she they have she, she has her own comic badass, book. But almost everything so far, she's been getting. But but no, seriously, she has her own comic book. Yeah, just Captain Phasma. And have you, and there's the, also the uh, the novel that's out right now is Phasma. Oh, um, I don't remember. Dude, who's all of the novels are going crazy, and a lot of them are reconfirming <laughs> old <laughs> legend stuff. So. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of them are going uh, in the canon because they when that final the. Uh, when they finally decided to make these movies, they cut out a lot of the old books. It's a ton. Well, mostly so it was mostly post. <laughs> it's mostly post episode. Sorry, six, Izzy, but those porgs are so ugly looking. Oh my god! See, <laughs> see, look at no. I'm pulling. Oh, oh, I can't pull up a picture no. of these porgs. <laughs> They're porks. Oh, empty sherry's on. Yay! Oh yeah. What the fuck's the Your mom. Hold awesome. on, hold on, Michael. You know that, right? Porgs. Even though she's sick right now, she's awesome. Love my mom. Hi, She's a badass. Oh, Porgs are awesome. Stop the hate from Clay what Hawkins. What the fuck Everybody. are those? It's so porg. You didn't know where a porg is? You haven't seen the new trailer, you piece of shit? So pull up the trailer. Really? Up my what? Oh. We're Star Wars, you Make son of a... Make the most annoying noise. Kill a fire. <laughs> what? Someone pull up the trailer. Kill a fire. I'm sorry. I'll pull up the trailer. No, no, no. We can't, we can't pull up the trailer. If we could pull up the trailer, we pull up the trailer. Hey, pull up the trailer. Aaron Shots, no, Aaron Shots. Cars are way better than Jar Jar, but Jar Jar's here to finish Annie's work, so oh, the no, no, no. Lisa Kim! I don't want to hear any hit on Jar Jar. He's a very underappreciated character. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, let's, let's, no. Who's the one that signed over the thing to the Sith? Jar Jar. Jar Jar has never. Jar Jar's the one oh, that yeah, signed that. the thing over. That's why he's an asshole. He is. He's the one that signed the clones to the Sith. I do really wish they'd give us a resolution of his death like such a good death like he yeah, like gets beheaded there's a bunch yes. of fan theories out there right now that he is actually the no one of the big heavy hitters in the set he might or at least in the public probably because he's not in the public no he's Sith his, he could be he an imperial the papers over to the Sith yeah but so did what's her name Amidala but yeah. but then he with wrote Anakin's all of the power his, uh, uh, light judgment notice I know but still it's just like hey I'm gonna take his word on this and just like sign it over. Fuck it. Yeah. yeah which gave and the clones to the Sith. Don't mind these two. They're oh, way, they're way better than Jar Jar. Ha ha ha. Yes, <laughs> indeed. They're showing him the trailer real quick. But I love having good. this many people for the cast. It's um, so funny, actually. Even though everyone probably doesn't show the same on the mic. You know. The okay. So the reason I say uh, Avengers is it after Black Panther? Yeah, it's a little bit. It's next year, though. Yeah. 2018, I think. It's Black Panther hits. Black Panther comes out in February. February. Literally, we wait less than three May. months yep. every month so far. I don't want to bring it up, but really, February, Black History Month. Come on, guys. Because <laughs> Black Panther doesn't deserve a whole... Any other thing, but it's like... <laughs> it's all right. That would be but messed hey, up, though. Know, this, but you know, no, someone has made... I have seen that meme, though, and the, the <laughs> comment, like, oh, he only doesn't know. But it, it does it not celebrate that. I mean, that's good. Point. But hear me it out, guys. A celebration. The reason why it's coming out in February because there's nothing that comes out in February. Yeah, February nothing ever really comes out. February is dead month. Like, because stuff comes out in March and January. February? Valentine's Day is the only thing in February. Yeah, but then you got Deadpool on Valentine's Day. We don't talk about that. That was Deadpool. a good rumor. We don't talk about Deadpool. But it's not coming out this year. I think it comes out next year. That was Deadpool 2? We might have to. We might also have to try. Is it next year or is it going to be um, the year after the next It's. I think it's next year. For de- oh, yeah, that's true. It could be next year. Because think about it. They did a Logan trailer. Oh, no, no sorry. It, it might be year after next because we're already almost doing it. Yeah. Uh, it might be. I can't remember. Is it 2019? I don't remember. I think it might be 2019. Does anyone have a Deadpool 2 uh, ETA? <laughs> Deadpool. I don't know. For Deadpool. I probably shouldn't be alone. But other than that, as we get our three other companions educated, or one companion educated on Star Wars, yep. and why, the reason why I say Pogs are better than Jar Jar, Jar Jar was that one character that just made the obscene noise, and I'm just like, why is he even there? <laughs> yeah, that, that, that noise, right there. I wanted to punch him in the face. I just Infinity can't wait Wars, for, yes. yes, Infinity War is going to be well. I, you know someone's going to be If they don't bring 
everything with Infinity War, I think that there's going to be some problems. No, if Infinity War doesn't show out the rest of the Marvel Universe, yeah, it, it's going to downhill from there. Yeah, mm-hmm. I guarantee you. Because if it that because that will that everyone will think that that is the tip point. Because the hype the hype behind Civil War was wrong. really high, and then they they did not do as well as they could have. They did with, do as well as um, they wanted to, but it's still one of the top three, I think, superhero yeah. movies ever made. That is true. I mean, with the Infinity War coming, you gotta bring out. <laughs> The thing is, Infinity War has to be number one. It has to be the number one superhero movie ever made. There's two parts. It might be three. There's theories. There's going to be the build-up. It's probably going to end somewhere with them. They theorize they might end it as, like, Infinity War, but they might end it as, like, a... Another character is kind of how they did Captain America Civil War. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That they might end it like that, but I don't think so because it's the June first, twenty eighteen. That's going to be great. I don't, wow, that's fast. Thank you, Clay. Christmas. You're awesome, Clay. Clay is the boss. Clay is on point. Be like Clay. Seriously though, and Halloween comes out next year. Oh, I think Venom is aiming for next year. Yes, dude, next year. Dude, next year's on fire. It's just on fire. Oh, it's Remember, on fire. Remember, it's Johnny's on fire. We, no, we, no, we, we, we have this, we have like this three-year thing where but this year we've had legit like a good comic book movie every three months. Yeah, yeah true. actual good horror movies. That's true too. There's been some bad ones. That's a jigsaw. Off. I'm sorry, <laughs> damn it! Because we had what? Logan was what? March or? Logan was March. I still I Deadpool, Deadpool was February. Was no, Deadpool this year? No, no Deadpool was last, last year. year. Um, but we had Logan, then we had what was it? Spider Man? Logan and Spider Man, which was June. Um, was we had the Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman, which is pretty good. There's and another one. Then we're having King. Or there's more. Um, Guardians. 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 There Guardians we go. was the beginning of the year. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it was really early. It was actually it was like right after Logan. Right after Logan, yeah. Because I think it was Logan in March and then oh, Guardians. Oh, yeah, it was Guardians in February. Yep. Yeah, it yeah. might have been actually. That was, like that, that was the only movie I, in February. And the thing is, honestly, like some people give it shit, but I felt like Guardians was, 2 was probably one of the best Marvel movies. Oh, it was awesome. As far as consequences, like it had some really powerful consequences compared to some of the other films. Oh, yeah. Yep. Like the the spoiler alert. Now it's almost been a year. Spoiler alert if you haven't seen Guardians of the Galaxy. Also, thank you for the likes. Squad, Jill. yeah. And the Gambit movie. Still excited for Gambit movie. We'll I'm excited, Gambit, but I'm yes. we'll so, get there in a moment. We're gonna finish up the yeah. Guardians thing. But the Guardians thing, like seriously, uh, spoilers for Guardians of the Galaxy two. If you haven't seen it, go watch it now. Stop this. Come back. Blah, 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 blah. We'll be here. We will be here forever. <laughs> Stop it. Finish watching the other movie. Watch uh, the other movie. We'll you die. Guys, in the saddest fucking way. Oh, oh my god. Like, because that's what, like, besides the Logan death, that was probably the saddest death of the year. Oh, no. Oh, no. He went out with such a bang, though. Dude, he went out with, it was such a good death. He went out like, he may have been your father, but he wasn't your daddy. <laughs> And it's like something that's so him, but it was also so deep. That, and then, you know, the back yeah. and all the other it's stuff. It's like you start, what are those characters you hate him at first? And they start to like him, and you're like, what? Oh, I mean, they built up to it, though. Like, they made him more endearing throughout the movie. They put him in the plight at the beginning where he's, like, suffering. Yep. Mm-hmm. Then they give him the scene with Rocket where he's like, I made a mistake. And he kind of redeemed himself with ego. It's like, oh, I didn't just kidnap the kid. I kept him from dying. Mm-hmm. Like, it really, like, re- resolves a lot. Oh, Jesus. The other thing is that people expected it to be a... Don't look at it anymore. Oh, God. What happened? Oh, God. They need a... I don't think it's fucked it up yet. They need a real actor to play Gambit. <laughs> what kind you of think Gambit? they will introduce Nova oh, anytime yeah. soon to the MCU? Gerald Davis asked. Uh, I don't think they will, but if they do, they're going to do it with Captain Marvel, and they'll do it right after Infinity Wars. I think Tatum had a good accent for it. Oh, I think we just went crazy. No, no, we're still good. We're still good. I was going to say. I think it's just me, because I have it on pause. Yeah. It just catches clips. Yeah. yeah. Uh, dude, he has an okay accent when he does it. Hi, I'll go. It's my little feet. Tatum should work. Was it good uh, in Kingsman, though? It was fun. F- it was, even if it was for five minutes. I think he could do it, and he's not the worst actor, but I do think that I want someone with a lot of Cajun experience to do it. There's some good Cajun actors out there like who could really play Gambit well. Honestly, the actor they got from Logan wasn't bad. Or the the Wolverine movie, whatever it was, Weapon X, I can't remember. The, 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 Lo- uh, the Gambit actor they had from that? That guy did... Nah, oh, man. I he had the action now, but, 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 but remember, it was, the, it was always the... Uh, <laughs> Special effects in that one that threw it off. Besides that, I felt like he played a good gimmick. Like he was a little sly, a little smooth. 
and a little first full. But the other thing is, Gambit, I don't even know. The problem with that Gambit though is that he really did not. Um, Wolverine Origins. Thank you, Gerald. Sorry, I, I've. I was just saying, Taylor. Hey, Tatum did a spot-on French accent. I'm sure he can do an accent, but. Yeah, they replaced they replaced the one from Origins with Channing Tatum, which was hilarious that they had to do that. But because hey, Channing Tatum was in Apocalypse, really I thought so. Yep. But uh, Taylor Kish, the original, I didn't like him too much. But I didn't. I don't remember too much of his of uh, his scene in Apocalypse either. Yeah, I don't. I think he was a side character. It was a uh, pretty decent. Tatum isn't a bad actor, though. No, I, I agree. He's not, he does a decent job. The thing is, he does get cast in certain parts. So. Yeah, like the funny buff guy parts. Yeah, the funny dumb buff guy parts. Funny yeah. dumb buff guy, yeah. There you go. Eye candy. That's all he <laughs> is. He's Back to eye candy. Eye candy. Hey, I can't say shit. <laughs> no. Nope. I can't say nothing about that. Uh, so besides Gambit and besides Guardians of the Galaxy, all right, uh, before the, not including Star Wars, obviously, Justice League and Thor, favorite movie of the year? Get yeah. Out. I still haven't seen it. Get what? Out. It's you not haven't bad. seen it? It's, it's actually oh, pretty it's good. Oh, it's fucking phenomenal. I need to take the time and watch it. I, I I heard good things, but even my friends didn't tell me they were that good. I thought it was pretty freaking good. Um, I'm sure it is. It lets I think it's gonna be something for me though. That's like, oh no, this is like life. <laughs> it's not real. Because I seriously, it's not what you think it is. I think it is because like, I yeah, will see. But I'll, I'll go watch it and see if it's if it's something that different. Then I'll be pleasantly surprised. Uh, yeah, you have to watch it. So, so are, are we limiting this to like movies that came out this year? Yes. Yeah, this year. This year. That's what I said. Fuck. I messed up. Can I have a number two? No. Oh, for sure. Yeah, well, that was a year. Favorite movie that, that I've seen this year? I would say the My Little Pony movie, but I have not seen that one yet. Oh. Good. Good. <laughs> because I'm sure it's sucks but anyway. <laughs> truly, truly favorite movie this year was uh, Blood War Bro. with Underworld. Really? You liked that? Really? Yes. Oh. That movie was I, bad no. ass. I liked it. I didn't think the story was good enough for it. It to was be terrible, but you know what? <laughs> <It was> <laughs> <laughs> but that leather, that eye candy, candy though. The <laughs> leather. Yeah, so Sometimes eye candy can be vicious fight yep. scenes. Did that other Resident Evil? Valerian. Valerian. Okay, we got. All right. All right. Here we got. We got stuff. Oh, also, Gerald Davis says Black Panther. Yeah, Black Panther. Can't wait till it comes out. Izzy says his favorite was it. It was really good. Oh, yeah, that was really good. Clay Hawkins oh, likes Valerian. Valerian. Valerian was Valerian a good was one. Beautiful. I heard it was really good, but it didn't follow the comic. Yeah, because a lot of people like, they didn't know. Uh, a favorite was. movie this year was for sure Marshall. If you haven't seen it, I recommend you do ASAP. Bozeman was excellent. Definitely a teaser for Black Panther. Oh, I haven't. I actually don't think I've seen anything with him besides him in Black Panther, so I'd love to see him in something else before I see him in Black Panther. Well, didn't, wasn't he in Jigsaw? Was that him? I think that was him. Oh, that was him, wasn't yeah, it? Was yeah. Him. But, uh, but it was, he was, he was that great of a. It's not even part. just like that. You don't do. He didn't do anything. Nothing like. Yeah, it was just there's no like effect. A security guard. Yep. Full on guard. Like he it's found some guard. flesh. Bam. He followed him. Took some pictures. Bam. I'll agree with you, Izzy. You, that's generally how it goes with most uh comp yeah adaptations. It's true. If I had that, that city market it. scene was. No, that was I, amazing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I heard that. That was the best scene. Was just the whole fucking visuals of that. I mean, that whole movie was just beautiful. It yeah. was a very, very pretty movie. I have to go, even though I know it's my bias, I have to go with Logan. It was just Logan. Good. Because great. I think the other reason uh, is I love old school westerns yo, because of the old fucking man. Wait a minute. Someone's saying ghost in the shell? I really liked it. You can say it, but I'm going to look at you for it right now. Oh my god. <laughs> drunk. Oh. It was, but it was a big role, yeah. Oh. Right, right, I need some right. clarification. Why? Yeah, p- can you clarify? Clay Gerald says he hasn't seen Ghost of the Shell, and he asked Clay how it is. I, uh, I didn't I've seen it, but I had to stop. I didn't even finish. I had to stop. <laughs> I had to stop because it hurt my eyes. Yeah, I haven't seen it. <laughs> Ghost in the Shell wasn't bad. I'm really spoiled by the anime, though. <laughs> Yeah, if you don't, don't judge me. I haven't seen the. Oh, okay. 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 Oh, you're, you're, you're forgiven, Clay. You're, you're forgiven. <laughs> I thought you were drunk. You're fine. You, you're not Stay drunk. on public. Stay on public. <laughs> oh, you're good. You're good. 
<laughs> if you ever get the chance, though, to see I'm just the kidding, uh, anime. It's awesome. It's so it much yeah, better than the it movie. Out. It's on every level so it much is, better. It is, at the time, if you can kind of, like, Compare. think about it, um, at that time that it was released, it was a it was meant more as a um, visual art exhibit than a movie. So it's very slow, but it's an amazing movie. It is. It's very uh, artsy, but like you said, but it's it's, it's very powerful. It's, I would watch it in the same vein as you would watch yeah, a good yeah, silent yeah. film. So it's more like you watch it as an experience. You're more to watch a screensaver, basically. How about I feel about the guy who got cast in Shazam? Zachary Levi. The thing is, everyone's making fun of Zachary Levi and how small he is, Joe. But people forget how small Chris Hemsworth and Chris Evans were prior to their roles playing Captain America and Thor. They were much smaller. Even when you think Hugh Jackman, go watch Hugh Jackman from yeah, like Hugh Jackman. Yeah, he, oh my god, he got so pumped for that, dude. He's so he's the best. I literally movie. didn't recognize him in some of those movies. Like he's so small. Yep. Hugh Jackman is a, is a beast. So I think Zachary Levi, and from what I know about him, as like I've seen him in a couple podcasts and a couple other things, he's a pretty cool guy. In general, he's like a nerd yeah, um, and a geek, but he's also really serious about what he does for a living and acting and all that stuff. Like he did some of his own stunts on Chuck. Yeah. Is, and so I think he'll get serious. Like he even posted on his like post about getting role and feeling the congratulations. He's like, all right, thank you guys. I appreciate my friends, family. Now I gotta go hit the gym for like forever. Yeah. <laughs> like, if he does the uh, the um, what was it? Who there was a guy that they did that. Um, oh, the new Hellboy is gonna be awesome. Man. That did uh, Boy, the new Batman Hellboy. and Superman. His Cat bulk Hulk. up. They're both. They're a person that helped them bulk up. I thought that was like, Wayne the Rock. I thought he did most mm, of those. No, um, they're, well, they're no, he like a, trains people too. To yeah, but um, there was someone There's that helps here. that helped um, Ben Affleck and what's his face get bulked up for those uh, movie roles, and they got oh, I gotta go try and demolished. Movie. But it was so it was so worth it for them to be very big and uh, helped them out. Yeah, it is. Like, to get big for the movies is important. And they did a good you gotta job. fit the role. You gotta get there, yeah. Um, it, yeah, he says, you ready for the new Hellboy? Yes, they have a new Hellboy. Is it, is it Ron Perlman, though? No, but they <laughs> showed a picture. Did you see the picture? No, I haven't seen Oh, dude, picture. it looks yeah. so good. He looks so. He looks like Ron Perlman's Hellboy. Yeah. Check out. It's online. It's easy to find. Check out the new Hellboy. I thought he looked good. I need to review all of this with my... He only have one... He, there's only one out of him. And it's an official release, I think, of him, like, as Hellboy, but I'm not 100% oh, sure. Oh, they went and just revamped the title. That's not good. It's, uh... I think Hellboy was just added to Injustice. No, it's not wrong, but the pick was pretty cool. David Agreed, Barber. Drew. Oh, the guy from Stranger Things is going to be in yes. the movie. He's Hellboy. Okay. He's Dude, I think he does an excellent job. There is, she found it. Okay, yeah, that should work. Like I said, they really took cues from Ron Perlman's Hellboy, yeah. which is good because that's very good depiction. Mm -hmm. And honestly, I think that actor can do the job pretty well, so we're going to see how he does. I'm, really, oh, wow. I'm hoping that it can be as dark as uh, the other one. The problem is maybe even a little darker. I would like it a little darker because yeah, real Hellboy was great, but the thing didn't they, go far enough. The other thing they need to add that they didn't have enough of in the original was they did dark, but they didn't do dark humor, yeah. which is a lot of what Hellboy is about. Yeah, Hellboy they, is is such a good character that it needs that dark comedy to go with it. Yeah, this it's kind of like uh, Deadpool, you know, yes. like it only works with murder. It's <laughs> like <it's> September. <laughs> murder um, and really good references. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, cable. Oh yes, cable. 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 Yep. They, They've uh, shown they some cuts in. in. What's his face? I kind of want to actually see that. God damn. What was it? what was who was Cable's name or the new actor who played Cable? Guys, I know it was. No, no it else. was, um, it was, it's the guy from, uh, Josh Josh Brolin. Josh Brolin, Josh Brolin. Yep. Josh Brolin. there we go. Everyone was no, complaining no, no. about uh, it. Uh, James Bond, it's a different person, actually. Yeah, but. They wanted the guy who was from James Bond, but they decided to go Josh, Josh Brolin. It was in the price cheaper. Range. Yeah, much cheaper. Much cheap price range and more somewhat believable. <laughs> oh man, that also sucks about that extra that died on the Deadpool set. Yep. Yeah. The stunt woman. It. Well, not an extra. She was a stunt woman. Sorry, just clarify. Yep. And you know, God rest his soul for bringing us entertainment 
That sucks. Let's have to die on set. At least you die doing it with love, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Imagine getting crushed under piles. Box it out. Uh, right. How shitty would you feel? Already, over, right? The sad part that's already happened. Domino's coming in finally. Yeah, she's in. They have pictures of her. Yeah. And oh they, my she, God. They got so much. Like, like, they got what so much hate. Domino? All right. How about you guys? How do you guys feel about the all hate on Domino for the the color? It's like, come on, the color of her skin is Domino. Like, did we is make it Domino? Like that, her skin is altered. Anyway, yeah. anyway, yes, it it's black and it's black and white. Yeah, so I they just did a reverse. They did white and black or whatever, because she, literally, because she's like an all white character with black spots. Yep. Hey, but now she's the race of MJ and Spider Man. They can do it they, anywhere else. They too. they did it with naked uh, Sonic. Sonic like Teenage Mutant. Yes, yes, she's like great. Legit. Is, if you've ever seen her, yeah. she is legit great. But, but in that, in Deadpool, she's not. She's white. Yeah. She's. Where's my Dio? Uh, dude, I can't. Zanze, Zanze beat, Zanze beats. She oh. was in. I'm trying to think of what else she's been in. Lots of stuff, I'm sure. Give me a second. Oh, she's. Give me a second. She was in, like, in something I loving. I tried the her rabbit hole of IMDb. Oh, God, yeah, that <laughs> is endless. It's like you never oh, knew they were in this. Oh, they were. Oh, that kind of crime. Um, Geostorm? Yeah. I thought it took her. I don't remember. I think it came out right. Uh, TV show at the end. New Geostorm. I'm yeah. really excited for the new Deadpool, honestly. And every, every small little teaser that they give out is just <laughs> spot on perfect. I mean, you got, you got, with the, even with the original, Ryan Reynolds sitting there on the bear rug, looking like frickin', uh, I just forgot his name. <laughs> <laughs> All wrapped up like a sexy Christmas hand. Yep. Yeah, this is beautiful. And then, Which, and then now they, they, they go with Christmas. Domino on the bear rug, so it's but, just even but better. But it's a Deadpool rug, it's not a bear rug. Yeah. It's a bear rug. No, it's a Deadpool it's, she's rug. She's on a Deadpool rug, yeah. I showed it to you. Uh, I forgot. You're a fool. And you went, oh, I've seen that. Well, I've seen the picture. I don't remember everything. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> now I see the little details. <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah, I forgot about that. That was so funny. She's Which like, is funny because she usually does beat him. Yep. Well, Domino's always been a good uh, counter character with, yeah. her, with, with Deadpool. The reason is her power is so abstract. You can use it. It's very similar yep. to Deadpool's kind of and abstract. This be her first appearance in I think a Marvel in live, series. Yep. In any, yeah, in any action. live action series. Yep. Yeah, she appears in some comics or not comics in some animated series, I believe, but not in uh, mm -hmm. maybe not in that. This might be her first yeah, live it's just appearance. In comics, period. Yeah, I'm trying so to be, be, be a bit in like uh, an X Men comic. She probably has shown up in one of the animated series. I think before. it's in one of the new newer X Men animated series or something. Maybe. I don't remember. There's a lot of stuff going on. Oh man, the new Gifted and the Gifted's much better. I will say, Gifted's got a solid seven or eight out of ten for me. It's really good. I have not finished the what they have out at the moment. I see them only on like episode four or something like that. It's not bad. You're almost there. It's only like You're episode six. There. Can we? Uh... Hang on, I might break this side. Can we talk about the uh, Pacific Rim yes. 2 coming out? Yeah, of course. Oh, Anything so that's hyped. coming out, man. I'm so dude, hyped. Boat Sword 2. Tell boat me that Sword 2. They better have a trailer with the Boat Sword. Okay. I better get a full Boat Sword. Are they dueling Boat Swords? It better be. Because they disappointed so hard last time that me and Lois almost left the theater. Happen. I'm, I'm expecting some cameo At least you of... What was it now? Of uh, both Idris Elba's character. Yeah, oh, wait, nice. no. Never mind, I'm sorry. I take that back. I am retarded. And I forgot how the movie went. Yep. The, that dude died. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it is his. Oh, man. Yes. In. So it's, it's a still reference, though. Oh, Mr. Captain Mr. Mr. It's like, you look yeah. just like your dead father. Yes. <laughs> Flashback. Oh. More flashbacks. <laughs> um, don't oh, put the of it. No, less no Naruto. No, no Naruto. Oh, no, you don't even know the go original Inuyasha, where even the story is flashback filler. Hey, Inuyasha was great. So, no. Okay. If you were a young teenage girl, exactly. I would rather you wanted to watch a long haired skinny man slay demons and save a prince. I would rather go on a fucking Kagome! Kagome! 
But no, Bullet Sword is going to be awesome. Bullet Sword 2. It's going to be so good. Dude, we got like a they, team now. But they need to get multiple well, Bullet Swords. Team. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, the other one died. Yeah. <laughs> all of them. All of them died. They really... Everybody. I like how they're bringing back the um, original suit, which is going to be good. He has a nice suit. by uh, Pentecost's kid and um, the new... New uh, female lead, I believe. Something, yeah, because it's the dual um, one right now. Yep, and then they got the uh, even bigger um, kaijus coming in. Oh, uh, that's going to be great. I hope they do a four-man one or something that was like, just mind or They were going to do a four They did the three-man with the... Uh, but they fucked that up. With the Japan uh, they squad. That up. And then they did the... Uh, they might do a four. I thought they did a trailer in the four man. There was a four. Maybe man there team. was a four man team. I forgot. But I thought three was. I know one of them is a one man squad, which is. I want to see what they bring up with that because they always were like had to be dual minds and yeah, have zero load. Well, and break your thinking, brain. Yes. Yeah. Which is going to be so good. I'm looking forward to it. It was the things that made wasn't necessarily good enough to merit a sequel, but I'm happy it's getting one. <laughs> I'm so excited. But this movie's gonna be great. Oh god, the first movie like I was so hyped for, and then I almost walked out after that scene of <laughs> no good. Forty five seconds of boat sword. Legit counted. That was it. It's like my boner was gone immediately. That's <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> uh, this is like flaccid. <laughs> <laughs> This is coming out next year. Oh, jeez, so much probably. I know there's got to be more DC stuff, isn't there? Isn't the Batman movie coming or something? Oh my god, uh, don't even talk kill about that. Just, just kill that. Just stop. Just let that. Just let that. Look, I gotta get right. more Batflex to let see that Harley's right. Right. Hey, I kind of like, like Batflex. I thought it, I thought it was a Batman and Harley movie though. Harley, I think, is yeah, on her own. Are, are they are getting her own movie. Yeah. Are they, are they um, doing a movie with all the chicks too called Sirens or something? Gotham City Sirens, I think. Yep, it's is a TV coming, series. But yeah. TV uh, series? Yeah. There's other Which stuff coming they're going to replay. Black Lightning was supposed to come out at some point here, but I still haven't seen any sign of it dropping. Uh, Cloak and Dagger is coming soon. Yeah, so is The Runaways, which is going to be awesome. Oh my god. I think god. Cloak and Dagger is next year? Early? Yeah, I'm not too excited for that. I think they're going to fuck it up, honestly. But I'm honestly not surprised if they do because... The, the other TV. thing is, that's an interesting pair of shoes. Yeah. Their whole background is like drug abuse. I think now that they're just they're just fishing for characters. I mean, the thing is, almost every character that has a comic book series obviously had enough of a following to merit yeah. comic book sales. So at this point, bring out whatever we see got. See if it works. The thing is that some of the series they pick up are still like classic, like New Mutant stuff. Like the New Mutants trailer for the horror stuff. Did you see that one? No, I haven't seen that one yet. It's awesome. It looks great. And some. It's gonna be just shit. waiting. There's that one, then The Runaways, which is coming out, which looks fucking amazing, and the comic book's awesome. And the premise is basically these kids find out that their parents are super villains, and they have powers or money, or, you know, yeah. very so things. Incredibles? No. <laughs> that was a, Where's my super suits? No. Yeah, except for your parents, you know, try to kill you. <laughs> yeah, every night. You know, and then you try to tell the police, the police work for your parents. It's like the Incredibles. No. What? That was not at all like the What movie, movie did you watch? <laughs> also, can we talk about Incredibles 2? That was not so. Incredibles, Incredibles 2. Too. The first uh, Disney sequel. Really. Um, they've uh, done uh, some of the. Uh, they've done. They've, they've got Finding Dory. Yeah. Only I wait yeah. fifteen yeah. Yeah. years. Yeah, years. I'm I'm be, I had to be serious Kirk black it. to. <laughs> I did my waiting. But well, yes, since, I mean, uh, Incredibles one. But let's, at what, least twelve years. So what's it gonna be the plot? Two thousand one, two thousand three. Uh, Incredibles. I think that was my freshman year. Of okay, high so it wasn't that far. High school. The more 2007. Do you, no, 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 yeah, that's right. It's almost been about 10, 12 years. I don't know why we're guessing when we all have smartphones. Don't look at my I just, I just like how it's Everyone like Incredibles 2, and then there's like literally nothing to talk about. <laughs> because because no just one has any fucking clue. They just announced yet. it. That's what, all they did. What do you think the fuck could be? Because we know that, like. I want it to start off at the end of where it was on the episode of Incredibles. Yeah, like, I was going to go watch that. 2004 was incredible. Okay, so I was not too far off. 13 years? Jesus. Yeah, 13 years. Oh. Yeah. It's gonna be more because it's no, gonna yes. be more because it'll it, come out next 
last year. I thought it was 2019. Halt your horses. It's hard to say. Everything's Hold been releasing horses. within like a this year or two lately. This is 2018. Their production schedules have like shot up so fast. You weren't going to release it for like 15 years or something. But that's crazy. Like the, the speed with which like they either finish or that or the length of time which if they're able to keep movies from us knowing about them is crazy. Well, that's the good thing about uh, most of the animated series. You don't know Jack Squat on some stuff. Until it comes out. Yeah. Because a lot of time those guys are only hired and they get very, very high, strong NDAs thrown at them. Yes, with very strong uh, payouts should they talk. Yep. And they get tracking on it. Like, they, yep. they do stuff now where they'll release information only to use so you and release it. Yep. And then if, when you do, they'll sue the fuck out of you. Yep. And they will win. Kind of like how uh, Blizzard works. Yeah. Soon. Much. Soon. When it's done. Soon. It's like, you know how much trouble uh, what's his name got in for broadcasting the first minutes on the premiere of Ragnarok? <laughs> it's like, haha, but seriously, Marvel, can I have my phone back now? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that was great, guys. That was a great one. Mm-hmm. Wait, what? I guess we can keep going. I mean, we've been on for approximately an We're hour. We've been on for an hour. But you want to shoot for a little longer? Or we good at an hour. I don't really know what else to talk about. Like, oh, there's a, the video game we, we can, can we talk can. about Dragon Ball Suit or like, Fighters. Dragon Ball Z. Fighters Z. Z. Like I said, there's a million million that things, but it's just how ass. long I'm we so, want to talk I'm for. Hoping it. that it's, what uh, really matters. What? I uh, hope that it's gonna be um, fucking. My brain just died. Whoa! Whoa. Which game? Dragon Ball Fighter Z. Uh. I uh, think he, yeah, his brain. Oh, his Assassin's Creed I hope it can be great. Out, it looks <laughs> Assassin's Creed Origins. Oh god, it looks more oh. Assassin's Creed. Oh. Hey, it's in Egypt now. Stop. Oh cool, it's not oh. too similar. Oh. Oh. Yeah. It looks beautiful. He doesn't. He's just he doesn't. He just stabs people. Dig your little hole in the He's gonna be like those fighters that throw sand on top of them. Like, <laughs> 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 you know, you know, oh, base oh, sheet. God. Wolfenstein 2 is going to be great. I'm ready to kill more Nazis. Oh my god, Wolfenstein. Yes. The, the, which one? Wolfenstein 2, the new Colossus. No, I haven't put that one yet. What do you guys think about the new updates to League coming? For the new when All we right. get the fucking Dude, I'm yeah, so yeah. fucking stoked for that shit. But you're going to buy no runs, bitch. Yeah! <laughs> oh man, Last right, of we Us 2. Last of Us 2. Wait, wait, nothing by anyone. <laughs> Skins. We'll either be the buy skins? Sequel. That'll make it worth um, it. It's 60,000 blue essence, but we'll be able to buy skins for free. That's cool, because then it takes a while. Well, no, because right now you can get certain skins that are like a million blue essence. Oh, jeez. And those are like the... But still, though, that's an opportunity to get skin and now never otherwise be able to Pro players that are complaining about their IP can spend it for no reason. Well, now they're actually giving you a reason to save your IP. I really want emotes for IP. Yeah, that would, that would or be Or even if it's a shit ton of IP. Well, we get emotes. Uh, emotes. 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 <laughs> through the new leveling system. Do we? Yeah, oh, that's a bunch of shit through the new leveling system. That'll be worth it. Every some odd milestones, we get like a loot box or something. Right, special. but are the emotes going to be in there? Yeah, they'll yeah. be in there. We get something super special for it, and then we get a. Uh, um, but we get something at every actual level, though. We get like a chest. Oh, that's they good. give you like a loot crate, and, and then it usually probably give you champion shards, which will be blue essence, which means that you'll use that essence to eventually cram something that comes out. Yep. You can't be able to cram. Oh, man, but so much fun. Which is worse because a lot of us already have everything. Yup. Except for Michael. Shut up! Oh. Has to start over. Who had everything and then had to start over. Because it's Michael. Not my fault. But it's literally all your fault. What the fuck are you talking about? Zero self control. What the fuck are you talking about? Zero self control. Zero it's all Axel's fault. How is that my fault? Because he's not a good friend who washes up for me. <laughs> I let you be the bad person you want to be. Is that such a bad thing? Remember, he's the bird in this situation. Fly, fly, man. fly, fly. fly. <laughs> oh, I'm not flying very good. He did ask the first the, two uh, times on your face. Carol, I think the uh, Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite was a flop because they rushed it and because everyone is more hyped for Dragon Ball Fighter Z. Not to mention the limited character selection on yes. Infinite was ridiculously bad. There's like, t- what? I think there's. F- I haven't. I don't even play it. Yeah. I literally bought it. Play like three times and I pulled it out of the goddamn box. Yep. Credit I was moving and had people in town. 
and different shit. But and then you've had it since it probably came out. Yeah, so. I had it. Well, like a couple days after, but yeah. Um, There's been no good reason. Like this, they also blocked streaming for the first week on Twitch. Yep. For everybody who didn't have it on PC or not. Yeah. And PC three was much better. It was a much better game. Yeah. I I love it. Um. That's why everyone's hyped for Dragon Ball Fighters. I'm just, I'm super good. hyped, but I, I want to, I wish I could do Dragon Ball for the moment. I'm just going to take my little, please, uh, this back, please, I don't want it, I don't, please, I don't want it. I'm just going to take my little update over a Warframe called Planes of Eidolon, and I'm just going to go fishing. That's what I want to do. Hopefully, uh, Bay Lake will have some more So, content. if any of you are interested in Warframe and wanting to watch, be. next week starting, I will be doing shenanigans on that. We can start mm-hmm. Sunday, by the way. Mm-hmm. When I get off at nine, it's up to you. I'll be over here at nine for me because I have to take care of stuff in the more day, but then I can set us up. And as you already saw through that one, we at least get the one with a wireless. Like I'm gonna talk to you about the wired, but but even if not, I'll get a wireless connection for this. But that's that's my two go to game. But a updated with Planes of Idolon. It's a 300 Is there meter overall besides map. Besides that, of PC coming out. Oh, I guess general jousting, Michael. Or no, oh Andrew God. wants us to get that general jousting. Go yes, ahead. which is terrible. But they just expanded to eight players. Whatever just came oh out my on God. PC would be uh, Destiny 2. Yep. Which, which was a giant flop for PC. Yeah, it should have uh, not have been put on PC. Not well, they it should have been. But at the but same the problem time, was that with all uh, people, with all developers that go from console to PC, they forget a lot of that stuff that's needed, like the ability to chat to people, the ability to be able to find groups. A game that requires you to have group yet is such a pain in the ass to get a group is not worth playing. Yeah, it's really difficult. You have, have a lot of PC of people. Even for me, like I've been playing. But I had to stop for a little because one, I didn't have anyone to run the raid with. Yep. I had, I could follow you and your group, but only if we were on at the same time. Yep. And well, my other I friend had no one to play with. I didn't have to be on, but yes, that would have been doable. No, yeah, I know you didn't have to, but I don't, you know, I don't know those motherfuckers. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Freaking, so that game, I don't, uh, the new update comes December 6th, the next expansion. That'll be cool. It looks good, but because they're going with an Egyptian theme, I'm um, hoping the armor looks pretty fucking dope but other than that looking pretty I'm kinda I have to look for my red <laughs> I have to look for the Red Dead Redemption 2 drop oh yeah Red Dead Redemption 2 which I great. might actually pick that up if I, I have it on pre-orders so that's nice. the only reason I, I think I need my pre-order though from that to Marvel vs. Capcom I should, which is I a should bad idea totally go over and play shenanigans but I was like gonna hop on the hype train for it and get it all hardcore and then it was a piece of shit yep which happens to a lot of games like get like uh, No Man's Sky. <laughs> it's like I decide to like splurge and get a nice game for myself, and then it's a piece of shit. So I need to stop doing that. Days gone, Daryl. I am. Uh, the game's gonna be interesting. I don't, I don't, see, I don't know, know if I want to keep going down the uh, the rabbit hole of zombie infected people, though. Yeah, I think it's, it's kind tough. of run its course. The, especially after Seven Days to Die and a couple other ones that's like the zombie infection thing. Yeah. We've we've really done a ton of it in the last several years and it's really it. Even shows and how movies. It goes. There's a waves. Of those, a lot of those good games. Come it's coming. Yeah. Well, even in movies they do it and like there's waves of like all right, horror. Horror. Zombies. It always it cycles. <laughs> yeah. But it cycles like zombies to killers, thrillers to screamers to... The only thing that's probably not going to come back is actual slasher films. But that's because slasher films are like too gory. Like, you can't really get... There's not a big enough audience for the it. The last good one was... Uh... That I, it good by my my definition is not good as others. It was uh, the Evil Dead remake. That was, that was hilarious as balls. Even though it really wasn't slasher, it, it was. It could have been they, they, If like they'd have kept in that one scene, I could have counted it as yep. slasher. But they took it out. Yeah. And I couldn't understand why because they showed it in the commercials and it was so fucking hardcore. And it would be like a game man. by Rocksteady, the guys who made uh, the Batman games. I'm, I guess I'm interested, but the thing is, I feel like it's going to be based off of the TV show at this point. My problem is, is would it turn more into Batman Arkham, or would it the, be oh, that's Green the thing. Arrow? The thing is, it's going to be, no matter what, Green Arrow is a, like a secondary of Batman. They literally made Green Arrow because they couldn't, they were tired of making Batman comics. They needed a Batman-esque hero. Yeah. My problem with Green Arrow, I don't feel like he's that great of a 
hero. Of a hero. I mean, yeah, he's he's a really good shot. Um, but outside of that, you, I don't really know how to make that into a game. I guess my thing is they're probably going to use his movement like Spidey a little bit, where he yeah. shoots. Oh man, the Spider-Man game is coming out. It's going to be so, oh, so good. It looks good. It's got a lot of hype. So I hope it's going to be bad. I, well, I mean, I hope it's got a lot of hype, so it's not bad. I hope it's gonna be bad, guys. <laughs> I did not mean to say it. You, you, you say exactly you, what you feel in your heart. You just you, want more shit to bitch at. You heard it here first. He's hoping it to be bad. He just wants it to hype. always be bad. It's not gonna be bad because there's been a lot of Spider-Man games, and they are all except awful. for New Dimension. No, that one. The New the one, was, one. I think. No, it was Spider- the Amazing Spider-Man game, yeah. I think. That was. one where you're allowed to swap between Venom and, and Spidey, that was fun. That was really good, too. That one was prior to that one. The last good one, though, was, I think it was the, oh, maybe, I don't know, maybe they know in the chat. But it's, it was either the Amazing Spider-Man, but it was the 2000 Spider-Man, I think it was roughly 99 or 2000, where you had free open world. It was like the first open world Spider-Man. You could swing to the buildings around the city and find yeah. your mission, and they pointed out to you of Target. Actually, that's probably one of the first open world target finding games. That's like even terrible Superman on Nintendo 64. I think... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Even there's a couple before, but that one was just so open. It was crazy. I'm so I'm stoked for the new one though, because it feels like that one. Honestly. It's gonna feel like a bit. It's gonna be Arkham Batman, but it's going to be Spider Man. Yes. Which I feel is a okay, uh, an okay thing as long as it's not too boring on the I combos the guys- and the way that the fighting works, because that's kind of the downfall with Shadow of War. New one, or sorry, the, the new one that came out is that it's held up by the Nemesis system, but it's not held up by the rest of the game. Ooh, no, it's not good. You got more yeah. than just fighting system. Which... Yeah. So I feel like the the Spider Man, it's gonna be great, but if they don't deliver on the story and if they don't uh, mix up the, if they don't handle the web slinging well and the Combat. In combat, which I think they got a good handle on that because that Arkham style combat is pretty tight. It is. It's just gonna they're gonna have to do different stuff for Spidey. A lot yeah. of it'll be ball based, yeah. ceiling based, which they still did with Batman. Don't get me wrong, but his will be from the ceiling. Yeah, from, wow. they did a lot of that with Batman. I found it funny how, how it was. It's like, very familiar. It was like a lot of old Spider-Man games where you could, like, that one open world, they had a lot, man. You could do shit like that. It was honestly precursor to Arger and Assassin's and stuff like that. Yep. I like the original PlayStation Spider-Man. I think no, that was the one we're talking about. Yeah. But the new one, it's going to be good as long as they the don't. The one where you screw. fought Carnage, Venom, off yeah, at the end. What DLC Our characters would you want in that game? Jeez, I want have Carnage. To, just, can I have Cosmic Spider-Man? Shit. <laughs> Is there a cheat for Cosmic Spider-Man? I mean, I was show? thinking more like characters along the lines like in uh, oh, Batman uh, Arkham City, like where you would play a couple levels as like Catwoman. Oh, uh, I mean, there's a ton. You could do Black Cat, which is obviously a rip. But yeah, Black Cat's a good one. Um, Venom. I want Punisher. Punisher? <laughs> Punisher show up. going to go bang, <laughs> bang, bang, bang. Call C-17. Bang, 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 bang. bang, 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 bang. bang. Um... He had a lot of side heroes who used to help him that were, like, not part of the rest of the Marvel Universe often, like the Prowler, yeah. Bobby, Bobby, Bobby Brown, I think was his name. And he's actually in some of the new stuff. There's another Spider-Man now who's the Spider-Man Spider-Gwen. in all the universe. All I want. Spider-Gwen, too, you could do. Yep. Spider-Gwen and would uh, Gwen Carnage would be good. Gwenpool. Gwenpool. Gwenpool would be great. Carnage Gwenpool is a piece of shit that needs Carnage to burn in hell forever. <laughs> Carnage Gwen. Gwenpool is essentially from our universe. Carbon the Hunter. That's Craven, yes. Craven, Craven, yeah, cool. Craven. Oh, the Sinister Six. You could probably put any number of them in there. Mysterio, yeah, Doc Ock. The problem is, like, finding people to play oh, with as, they like, did, uh, They were talking about, what was it, Kingpin? What the villain that they were showing in the... Oh, uh, yeah. He's, his, he's a big villain for his fight. The, um, yeah, he's oh, wait, no, it wasn't Kingpin. It was the guy that changes faces. Chameleon. In the, uh, in the trailer. I don't remember who they had Spider-Man. in the trailer for this one. I it thought was. it was Kingpin. Yeah. But they're pretty much Kingpin, Kingpin, which is cool because he really hasn't gotten too much show. A he, lot of Yeah. He did an alright show in Daredevil, but I felt like they dumped they dimmed down his evil by explaining it. Yeah. Like 
And my friend was like, no, that makes it even evil. I was like, no, that like humanizes him. That makes gives him a reason, probability for like being the way he is. As opposed that's to what a lot of, that's what a lot of uh, movies and stuff have been going along those lines of why, um, which is kind of why uh, the Halloween movies that Rob Zombie made are interesting because they humanize Michael. Which I, it, I, I thought it was interesting. make it more but, like, oh, he's just a troubled kid. And he's a really fucked up troubled kid, but he's a troubled kid. Um, and you don't... Because uh, the way he was portrayed in the others, he wasn't as, like, Yeah, he was just bad shit crazy, yeah. yeah. I know, and I feel you. Like, I understand what you're saying, but like I said, I feel like... It also especially dumbs it down sometimes, too, because that's what a lot... Like I said, that's what a lot of recent stuff has been doing. They're trying to, like, humanize and get it more relatable. Which is cool, but your villain shouldn't necessarily be that relatable if you want to take strong action against them. Yep. Ah, I don't hate on them, <laughs> Hey, 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 hey. Hate on Hey, 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 hey. hey, hey. Oh, Squirrel girl. Hey, 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 hey. You just have a lot of hate for that character. Squirrel girl has to burn and die. Other, other than Roasted that. squirrel tonight. What's wrong with squirrel? Oh, every fucking thing. <laughs> oh like, my god. god. No. Do you know what her fucking real name is, first of all? Her name is Doreen. Doreen. Yeah. Her name is Doreen. No. Like that pisses me off. Yeah. Dory. Like blue Dory. guppy thing that's in Nemo. Dory, no. No, Dory, not Dory. <laughs> Doreen. Green. Okay. In there. No hate, though. <laughs> <laughs> no, hate. no hate on other Doreens, just that specific Doreen. Yep. And then she's from Minnesota. Does she have a Minnesota accent? I don't know if they write that in, but she should. <laughs> I, was, I was saying she has a yeah, Minnesota accent. Oh, they have it. You don't know they Minnesota? They They're from Minnesota. Bad. It's about as bad as Canadian. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> don't you know? Don't, don't you know? know? Hey. What are you talking about? <laughs> yep. Yeah, they don't do boots, Sorry, though. Canadian audience. <laughs> even they're not here. <laughs> I had Wally Patterson in the back alley with... <laughs> Stop. Uh, okay. All right. I think that's Cast probably good for the Fail Come Convos cast. They, thank you to everyone for coming. A short hour special. Uh, yeah, that's been our usual lately. We made it to an hour and 15. 18. Oh, is it 15? Yep, 16 barely. That's all right. That's not too bad. You know, uh, thank you for everyone who joined. Jarrell, and uh, we had Clay, and we had Izzy, and we had all these nerds. <laughs> yep. Yep. Uh, also, special shout out to the Patreons from Patreon.com slash Comic Convos who support us, including Mikey, who, uh, you know, enabled all this to happen because the fail guys would never come down without him. No, I came down anyways. I was on vacation. This is <laughs> on vacation. He just well, died. you would have come down, but you would have come down for this. Yeah. Yeah. He's like, yeah, yeah all right, you're right. I, I actually scrambled to come down here, so. <laughs> but regardless, uh, thank you, Mike Neve. I wanted to say thank you to Cy Kennedy, Susie Marie, Tyler Lockridge, and uh, Kevin Schrute. Kevin's name always tries to escape me. I don't know who else is on there. Don't let me kick you. I don't yeah, know. You give me this list of our patrons. I would love to congratulate them. <laughs> don't worry. Eventually, we got to get patrons you, on your. You're the boss, task. and you do not give us any information. So he wants us. I give information, but you don't do what I say. So, oh. so I, I ask for this, this, and this, and, this and no one delivers. Uh, I give answers. Just for AD, oh, they give you JKZ. Oh no, they, I literally get nothing. There's no JKZ. <laughs> It's literally nothing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Signing off. If you enjoyed watching or want to support the channel, remember to attack that like button. Subscribe on YouTube, follow on Twitch, or join our Discord using the link on screen or in the description below so that you can get daily updates on all of our uploads and live streams. We know we're not perfect and we can always improve, so please visit our Discord or comment below with a critique or a compliment to let us know how we can improve ourselves. Finally, if you're just starting for more content, you can become an honorary member of 3D Productions at patreon.com slash 3D and get a exclusive access for as low as a dollar a month.